at the auction looking for my next project and I found a, a 2014 Chevy Cruze with minor front end damage. This is the one I've been watching online, waiting for it to come up for sale. And uh, I did want to start buying a few Chevy Cruises. Um, I did want to buy a, a few Chevy Cruises, but the reason why I was looking at this car, this particular car, is because it's a six speed manual transmission. And uh, a car like this, I actually would probably hold on for a while. I'd hold on to this car for a while because uh, I love the um, manual transmission. And uh, yeah, these Chevy Cruises, you can replace this whole center unit with the nice Tesla style large screen. So I'm probably going to be doing that if I end up getting the car. And that's OnStar. It's just a base model, but it's a base model with the six speed. You can get these with RSs. They're more like the fully loaded one with the six speed. Uh, I love it when you find uh, paperwork in here. You see this every once in a while. The Carfax 2014 Chevy Cruze LS. True previous owners. Looks like they got this car from uh, Carvana. And this car used to be in New Jersey, so I'm definitely going to have to look for any signs of rust. New Jersey in 16. And New Jersey all the way up until 2021. And then it went up for uh, for auction. It sold to Carvana in um, Rochester, New York. So that's good to know. Usually in, in uh, my state, we don't usually get... Uh, vehicles with rust. Uh, let's see. Looks like they paid or they financed um, $13,647 and change. I think this car is probably about a $7,000 car every day. Maybe a little bit more. But who knows? Seatbelts aren't locked up. Overall, it's pretty clean. Pop the trunk. It looks like this car is pretty clean. I was bought a couple years ago at Carvana, so they probably went through it completely. Hmm, no backup camera. That's interesting. I'll have to add that. Oh, clearly this person was in in the medical field of some some sort. A lot of masks, a lot of medical type stuff. Interesting. Uh, New Jersey car. You even get rust on the um, on the screws for the rear the um, backup lights. I mean the um, license plate lights. Interesting. Well, I'm gonna put the camera underneath the car, see if there's a whole bunch of rust. Can't feel any. More damage on the bumper cover right there. So this looks like the primary damage. And when I was looking at this car online, I want to make sure the frame rail wasn't bent. But on these Chevy Cruises, I believe they bolt up. Half it bolts up anyway, so these are actually not hard to replace. Looks like it's pretty straight. Radiator sports a little bit bent, 
but that can be bent back out. Interstate battery, nice. Coolant looks good. Little leak around the valve cover. Oil looks looks okay. Has brake fluid. Oh, if there's rust on this car, I can't see it. I'm not sure how you have a car in New Jersey and don't have a whole bunch of rust. Hmm. Interesting. Oh. I'm looking the other side. a really clean car but I'm mostly interested in it because it has the um, the six-speed transmission So we'll see what this car ends up going for. But I'm probably gonna pay a little bit more than I otherwise would just because I want I want the six speed for my next project. But there's a couple more Chevy Cruises I'm gonna look at. And then uh, depending on which one's the best, I'm gonna come back and maybe take a second look at this one. Anytime I'm at the auction, I'm always looking for Chevy Cobalts, and this one's a 2009 Chevy Cobalt. I think it's an LT. Yeah, Chevy Cobalt LT. It almost looks like a sport with the larger exhaust, the ground, eff the, um, ground effects. Oh, these are almost brand new tires. But they're dry rotted. Ooh, leather interior, OnStar, sunroof. It's like paint or something. Hundred five thousand miles. This car looks real clean. Mm, I don't know what all that stuff is. Paint maybe. Wow, it even has a Pioneer sound system. This really does look like an SS only with an automatic. Nice little spoiler. Anytime I see front end damage like this, I always get uh, engine leaking, huh? Mm. I always get suspicious of um, frame rail damage. It looks like it's pushed up a little bit.
Yeah, it definitely looks like it's pushed up. Clearly, the person that had this cart took care of it. Looking for my next car, which is another 2014 Chevy Cruze. Oh, it looks like this one's from Florida. So we gotta make sure it doesn't have any water damage or anything. Faded there. Hmm. Other interior. Seat belts aren't locked up. Looks like this one has 133,642 miles on it. Hmm. Like the leather. Did maintenance on it. That's good. Monster sunroof. Coolant looks good. Frame rails look good. Oil looks good. interested in this car. Tires look good. So it needs a bumper cover, a fender, headlights, That's about it. Definitely some detail and refinish. Hmm. 